Good afternoon, I'm Peter Hitchener. It's Judgment Day for Essendon, with a decision due at any moment on whether Asada's investigation into the club's supplements program was lawful. Let's cross live to Seb Costello at the Federal Court. Seb, what will happen this afternoon? Good afternoon, Pete. Well, today may well be the most important day in this 19-month-long saga. Today, in a best-case scenario for Essendon players, they could see this whole saga swept aside and they could be free to continue their professional careers. Of course, there always is the alternative decision that Judge Middleton could make in just minutes. But, Pete, this saga never Did fails to surprise. Friend. And just seconds ago, one of the most extraordinary developments in this whole thing, silent for so long. Stephen Dank, the sports scientist at the centre of this whole case, who has refused to talk to Asada for months and months and months... 1st of October 2014, indicating opposition to this order as to costs, the applicant pay the respondent's costs of and in connection with the proceeding to be taxed in default of agreement. We will now adjourn the court. And so, as you can see, that concludes Justice John Middleton's judgment in which he dismissed the actions, the claims rather, by Essendon and James Hurd over Asada's actions. Now, let's cross back to Seb Costello at the Federal Court. Seb, what does the judgment mean? Well, Pete, I think you can probably assume that the feeling that James Hurd and the Essendon Football Club have right now is one of shock. This Wait is a court. lot. We'll be leaving here in the forecourt. And, Pete, the Nine News cameras are here to get their reaction as it happens. The first words from James Hurd after this surprising defeat. OK, thanks, Seb. And uh, join us for all the reaction to the federal court decision and uh, we'll be covering that all afternoon and of course have details in Nine News tonight at 6, updates throughout the afternoon and at ninenews.com.au. Thanks for joining us this afternoon. For now, it's goodbye.